thank you for this day, Lord Jesus. Oh God, oh God. We thank you, Lord, for being the God that's concerned about everything about us on today, Jesus. We give you the glory, honor, and the praise, Lord, for you are the only true and living God today, Jesus. We thank you, Lord, for life, health, and strength on today, Jesus. We thank you, Lord, for a reasonable portion of health and strength on today, Lord Jesus. We thank you, Lord, for, for seeing a brand new day on today, Jesus. Another opportunity is to say, thank you, Lord Jesus. Another opportunity to lift up your name on today, Jesus. And for that, we're glad on today, Jesus. We thank you, Lord Jesus, for everything that you've done, Lord Jesus. For the sunshine and the rain, Lord Jesus. For our down and our uprising on today, Lord Jesus. We thank you, Lord, for taking us through on today, Lord. For keeping our hearts and minds stayed on you today, Jesus. There's nobody like you, Lord Jesus. We thank you, Lord, for your unconditional love on today, Lord. That seems beyond our faults. And see our every need today, Jesus. And we thank you, Lord Jesus, for this day, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord. We come into your house and say, thank you on today, Lord. We come to lift you up today, Jesus. We come to magnify your name, Lord Jesus. We come to praise you, Lord Jesus. From the inside out on out today, Jesus. We thank you, Lord Jesus. For being in the midst today, Lord Jesus, we pray, Lord Jesus, that since we came into your house, that you will have your way, Lord Jesus. Lift the heavy burdens on today, Jesus. Heal the minds, Lord Jesus, the body and soul on today, Jesus. Touch us again, Lord Jesus. Touch us again, Lord Jesus. Oh, hallelujah, Jesus. We need you, Lord Jesus. We can't do anything without you, Lord Jesus. We can't even survive without you, Lord. We can't breathe without you, Jesus. We can't move without you, Lord Jesus. We can't think without you, Jesus. Oh, hallelujah, Jesus. You are the source, Lord, of our blessings on today, Jesus. Oh, hallelujah, Jesus. There's some people that come into your house, Lord, that are burdened down, Lord Jesus, that feel like giving up, Jesus. That's at the end of the line, Lord Jesus. Help us to know you, Lord Jesus, as a personal savior, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. You adopted and never lost a case, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. You're better than any physician, Lord. You're better than any therapist on today, Lord. Oh, hallelujah, Jesus. Heal the mind, Lord Jesus. Heal the mind, Lord Jesus. Heal the mind, Lord Jesus. Heal the heart to Lord Jesus. Heal the soul, Lord Jesus. Oh, hallelujah, Jesus. Bind up the brokenhearted today, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Break out revival, Lord Jesus. In this land on today, Lord. Break out revival, Lord Jesus. In the church homes today, Jesus. Break out revival, Lord Jesus. Heal the land, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. We thank you, Lord Jesus. We don't want our coming here to be in vain, oh Lord Jesus. Oh Lord, lift up the hump down head, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Oh, hallelujah, Jesus. Oh, hallelujah, Jesus. We can't afford to give up on you, Lord Jesus. If we give up on you, Lord Jesus, we have no way to go on today, Jesus. We thank you, Lord, for new life. 
and new understanding of your word, Jesus. Lord, we're going to lift up your name on today, Jesus. We're going to magnify your name, Jesus, because you're worthy to be praised. I don't want no rocks, Lord Jesus, to cry for us today, Jesus. We're going to lift our voices, Lord. We're going to say thank you, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to your name, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Bless us, Lord, according to your will. In Jesus' name, thank God. Amen. Psalms and it reads, The earth is the Lord and the fullness thereof, the world and they that dwell therein. For he had founded it upon the seas and established it upon the flood. Who shall ascend into the hill of the Lord? Who shall stand in his holy place? He that had clean hands, a pure heart, who had not lift up his soul unto vanity nor sworn deceitfully, he shall receive the blessings from the Lord and righteousness from the God of his salvation. Amen. Amen.
Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus, for being good to me. Thank you, Jesus, for being good to me. Thank you, Jesus, for being good to me. Praise our God. God bless you on this morning. May the Lord smile on you is our prayer on this very special day that we call Mother's Day. Praise the Lord. Thank God for all the mothers this morning in the house. Amen. Ah, amen. All the mothers, would you all stand and let us give you all a round of applause here, all the mothers. Give us a round of applause. Oh, just by the round of applause. Praise God. Hallelujah. No, brother, baby, you ain't no mother. Praise the Lord. <laughs> Thank the Lord. <laughs> Praise the Lord. God bless you. Amen. Brother David's happy this morning. To, amen. He said, Well, I'm able to stand and say I'm happy. I just might able to stand with the mothers. Praise the Lord. Thank God for Jesus and for his precious blood that covers, amen, our sins. Praise the Lord. Had it not been, had it not been for the love on my side, where, where, where would I be? Where would I Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hmm? Ah, thank the Lord. Bless his name. The song said, where would I be? Glory to God. Thank you, Lord. For he drove all my enemies away. Turned my Glory to God. Hallelujah. Had it not been for the Lord on my side. Hey, thank you. Hallelujah. Every time I look around, amen, another blessing come in my way. Thank you. Blessings of strength. Blessing of health. Blessing of peace. Blessing of joy. Blessing of hope. Blessing of mercy. Just keep on blessing. Thank the Lord. Keep on blessing. Glory to God. Huh? Thank you. Sometimes look like the enemy got the best of you. But then God. Glory to God. <laughs> God. Glory to God. So Janice opened the door. Amen. And, and makes a way. Thank the Lord. Mr. Jackson, look like things going to get cloudy and get rough. And bless his name. And and, and look like it's going to start raining and never stop. But then be, be behind that cloud, amen, that the Lord let a beam of sunlight just beam through that cloud. Let you know I'm still here. 
Huh? I'm still here. I'm still looking out for you. Don't worry about it. The enemy hasn't got the best of you. Thank you, Lord. I'm still God. I'm yet God, and I'm yet God in control. I'm in control. Huh? I'm in control. I'm in control of everything. Thank you, Lord. Huh? Bless his name. I speak to the wind, and the wind obeys. I speak to the water, and the water obey. I speak to the birds, and the birds obey. I speak to the mountain, and the mountain moves because they hear my voice. Thank you, Jesus. Ah, hallelujah. Thank you. Ain't nobody, ain't nobody like Jesus. Hey, ain't nobody like Jesus. Ain't nobody like Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Ain't nobody, 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 nobody like him. Bless his name. Hallelujah. God bless you this morning. Praise the Lord. Ah, I'm off to a good, amen, hot start here. Praise the Lord. Let me see if I can slow down a little bit. Thank you. Bless his name. They said, when I think of the goodness of Jesus. And what? And, and what? And all that he done for me. Not that all, that all, says Jackson, that all just keep on going. It, it don't stop going. Glory to God. Ah, glory. Hallelujah. It just keep going and keep going and keep going and keep going. And that's why you can't stop saying all. Oh, done to me. What happened to you? My soul. My soul cries out. I can't help myself. I got to say something because I think about what he's doing for me. So I have to say something. What I say? I say what? Hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Thank God for saving me. Thank you, hallelujah. Didn't deserve it, but it saved me. Thank you, should have killed me, but it saved me. Should have forgot about me, but it saved me. Should have thrown me away, but it saved me. The song said, he saved me, he saved me, how glad I am, he saved me. He saved me, how glad I am, he saved me, how glad I am, he saved me, how glad I am, I've got Jesus on my side. Amen. He saved me. How glad I am. Praise our God. God bless you this morning. It is, amen, what we identify as Mother's Day throughout the civilized world. Amen. And we're going to take a moment, and praise the Lord, allow you, amen, even if yours has gone on to glory, amen, you can say thank God that you was blessed to have, amen, a loving mother, amen, praise our God. So we're going to take this time, amen, and, and allow you the desire to say something on your mother's behalf on this morning. Praise our God. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Yes, yes, praise the Lord. It, it, it may be an emotional time, praise the Lord, but it's an emotional time of joy not of regret, not of sadness. Amen? Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Thank the Lord. Yes, because, amen, I had one of the best in the world. Amen. They don't come like, amen, the one I had. Amen. She's been gone 46 years. Praise the Lord. But she was one of a kind. Sister Jackson, God bless you, dear.
so prepared, so kind hearted, so loving, and to be married to my dad, yeah, long suffering. He had to have patience to be married to my dad. It took a lot. Because <laughs> I was a kid and I couldn't wait to be 18 years old and go off to school or get my own apartment and get whatever. But my mom Pastor was going to let us off, you know, we just keep going with the service. Got to hurry. Um, so I'm just, I, I mean, how could I sit down and not talk about um, my twin? <laughs> um, I, I don't, the other, there was a few Sundays ago, um, Sister Linda O'Neill, she was illuminated. The Spirit was working with her and she was making laps around. <laughs> and then she got over to Mother. And uh, the spirit led her to lay in mother's lap and mother prayed for her. And oh, how I, dare I say, envied that um, to see that and to wish that my mom was sitting in that chair so I could lay on her lap and <laughs> have her pray for me. But I know that she did already. When she was here, she spent many a nights and many a mornings on her knees moaning 
and groaning and things that can't be uttered. Only the spirit knew what she was saying. But she was praying for us, for our safety, so we could, uh, for our well-being. Mm -hmm. And she was, um, I mean, y'all know already, but she was, she was awesome. And I can't find a platform big enough to express mm -hmm. how great, how great she was. She was kind beyond kindness. And I was like, why do you keep doing stuff for these people? She said, that sometimes they don't like you. <laughs> but she couldn't help it. <laughs> she couldn't help it. She had to be, she had to be sweet. <laughs> um, and she took care of that household. Um, there was nothing that she wouldn't do for dad. Nothing she wouldn't do for our sisters and for me. And I'm grateful every day. Yes. For her, I'm grateful every day. Bless and, and you know, y'all get used to these because every Mother's Day I'm going to pull out an Evelyn hat. <laughs> Today I went easy. I said, I'm going to get a small one and I'm going to take it easy. But next, next Mother's Day, they're going to get bigger and better. <laughs> I want to honor her as much as I can. God bless you. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Amen. I, I had to get a little refund for these hats, though. Baby. Amen. Praise the Lord. God bless you this morning. God bless your mother. Praise the Lord. One of y'all stay with me today. Praise the Lord. She was one of the greatest warriors that I have ever known. Mm -hmm. She was sweet, loving, and very kind. Mm -hmm. She was a second grader. My mother was a seamstress. She could just just look at a pattern and can sew mm -hmm. a suit or whatever you wanted. She would sew it, and she was the best cook. Lord, how much! Look at that. Yeah. And then she would teach me. Mm -hmm. And every time I got ready to make biscuits, I had to go to her to ask her. How do you make it every time? I never thought about it with them. <laughs> how to make biscuits, but she taught us how to cook and definitely how to clean house. My house is, our house is very clean and orderly because she washed a lot. She had 11 children. And my mother, she sold for the church and uh, made uh, robes and what have you. I can't remember all the things that she did, but I do remember her. And, uh, and Russ, my dad, and Jimmy, my dad built our home just to be a home. And he was like that since his younger days. And uh, I remember sitting on the well, and he dug the well in the backyard. And I sat on the well for weight. But nevertheless, I thank God for them. They were just grateful just a love and what my mother was doing she was a teacher and she had so much ability for a two for a second grader she could talk to anybody and I, I think how did she know how to how did she know how to what to say and what to do and how to do it but she did it and I thank God for her pray for me and my children God bless your mother <laughs> beautiful praise the Lord Thank God for Jesus. Hallelujah. Bless his name. Uh-huh. Amen. Happy Mother's Day to all you mothers. Uh, uh, most of you all, some of you all knew my mother. Uh-huh. Uh, I, I recall all of my first cousins at one time or another calling my mother mother mm -hmm. mama until they got to be eight nine in that area but all of the all of us as children when we were coming up they called my mother mama call their mothers by their first name that's right and uh that that uh and, and it didn't really register to me until i got older an adult grown 
that she was a mother oh, wasn't you. to all of her nieces and nephews and, and other children when they come, you know, and I have some that weren't legally adopted, but they were raised in Dorothy's house. And uh, when you came to Dorothy's house, if you was a friend of her children and you stayed the night, you went to church. It you, you, you didn't matter what you came in. You know, now children say, well, they ain't bring no church clothes. You wore what you had on, and you went to church. And you stayed at church 10, 11 o'clock at night during the week, Sister Freedom. And as I got older, I, you, you know, when you get out, you start doing what you want to do. But I, you know, came home and I stayed with my mother, when especially when she was by herself. And I recall one time coming in one night, and I'm, you all may have heard this, she was sitting, she had a chair right by the door reclined. And she was sitting in a recliner, and I came in full of whatever I was into out there. And she was sitting there, and she had started calling me Buster by then. She said, hey, Buster. I said, hey, Mama. She said, uh, I just got through praying to the Lord about you. I said, okay. You know, I was ready to go and get in the bed. I was sleepy, and whatever was on me was telling me to go to sleep. And she grabbed me by the hand. And uh, she said, I told the Lord, whatever it takes, save you. And she was looking at me in my eyes. And whatever it was that I had been drinking, Sister Frieda, it was gone. Because I saw the seriousness and the urgency of what she was praying. She taught us to pray from little kids. She would make us get on our knees beside our bed, and all we knew was, here I lay me down to sleep. But she taught us that until we got older. And we got older, and she, she would come. When we, it was time to go to bed, she'd pass through there and say, did you say your prayers? Get out that bed and say your prayers. She knew that we... She wanted her children to be saved. Whoever was around, she was going to tell you. If any of you all knew it, she was going to tell you right no matter what. But she told me that that night, she said, I told the Lord, whatever it takes. I said, well, Mama, you act like you want the Lord to break my leg or something. She said, he can break your leg, your arm, and your back as long as he saved you. I went and sat on the side of the bed, Sister Frieda, I, I couldn't go to sleep. That that was telling me to go to sleep, Brother Jameson stopped. And I sat there, I know, three or four hours. She got up and got ready. She was on dialysis at the time, and she was getting ready to go to dialysis, and I was still sitting on the side of the bed. She walks in there, and she said, you ain't sleep. I said, no, ma'am. She said, okay, well, I'll see you later. But she was the type of mother that loved you enough. Not just mother, but auntie, cousin. What she loved you enough to tell you, you need to be saved before you get out of here. I, I, all of the, s I have still have those that not even related to me that call me brother. Their brother because of my mother. I just, sweetest, lovingest, but stern, one of the most stern mothers you could have, but sh she, she knew the urgency and the, of getting saved. That was it. Amen. Praise the Lord. God bless you. God bless you. Praise the Lord. Come on, Brother Marcus. Come on, baby. Praise the Lord. We're praying for this one. Amen. For the Lord get through spanking her real good. She's going to be all right. The Lord get through spanking her real good. He going to spank you. Don't worry. He can spank you too. Come home. This is what it was. And when I got here, it was like 
she'll be sleeping and she'll wake up and call me up. And thank you for that, because a lot of my friends don't have that same support. And like he was saying, I have so many friends that have called their mother throughout the years. Oh, where mama at? How mama doing? And I'm like, she's still crazy. She's still around. She's still, <laughs> she's still the same person. She's still here. So I thank God for keeping you here and keeping me with you. Um, another thing, I woke up this morning. started playing gospel music and it's like I've said it before I felt big mama come through she was like come on baby you need to come like it's it's time to go and I was walking through the house and I was singing and I walked to the little plaque that she gave me for everybody to put in and I I promise it was like a little light came down in my spirit and I was like I love you mama and I told her happy mother's day and I love you anyway to make a long story short I went and got flowers for my so I got them for my mother, I got them for my auntie Nisha, and my auntie Mary, because I love you ladies so much. You guys mean the world to me, and I just hope that you have an amazing day. So happy Mother's Day, and I love you. God bless you, baby. God bless you. Praise the Lord. God bless you. Thank you, Lord. All right. Sister Jessica, that's so sweet of you, baby. Amen. That's so sweet of you. You, you. you do know the Lord uh, loves you, don't you? All right. Amen. And you do know, amen, he gives you that pretty voice to use for him, don't you? Okay. All right. I just want to make sure we're on the same page. Okay. All right. And you do know if you don't, Amen. Youth for him, he gonna spank you real good, you know. And sometimes his spankings is unpleasant. Oh Lord, they can be unpleasant. All right, come on, my mom's come on, my mom's come. Oh yeah. All right. You wanna come to the pulpit? You ain't ready for the pulpit. All right. Okay, Pastor, I was going to give a presentation from the Brotherhood yeah, to yeah. the young man. So the Brotherhood have provided flowers for all the mothers on today. And not only the mothers that are living, but the mothers who have mothers who have gone on. So we can present the mothers who have a mother that has gone on with a special flower for their mother. Because you would not be the mother who you are today without the mother that you had. So we want to honor that as well. So if I can get Ethan and Aiden and RJ, any other brother that wants to come and help assist with passing out these flowers for mothers, we can do that at this time. Come on, boys. Come on, right. All right. Well, look at here. RJ, look at here. Come on, RJ. All right. My goodness. Praise the Lord. That's so beautiful, ain't it? That's so beautiful. God bless you, brothers. Amen. Amen. All right. All the mothers, amen, raise your hands so they can bring you a flower. Praise the Lord. If you're a mother today, raise your hands so they can bring you a flower. These boys look, they looking good at that. Hey, come on, mother, raise your hands so they can bring you a flower. Give her one, RJ. Give her a hug there. Tell her don't squeeze you too tight now. All right. Praise the Lord. Isn't that beautiful? That is so beautiful. God bless you, brothers. God bless you, brothers. That is so beautiful. Thank God for you. Amen. All right. Amen. Bring one to the choir stand with you. Amen. Bring two to the choir stand. All right. God bless you. How beautiful. How beautiful. God bless you, mothers. Oh, my, my, my. Thank the Lord.
Bless him today. Bless him today. Sweet Lamb of God, the hope of glory. Hey, ha, ha. Thank you. My God, my God. Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Quarsy. Praise thou. Praise the Lord. Praise our God. Bless his name. Thank you, RJ. Thank you, Lord. How great is our God. Sing with me how great is our God. How great is our Bless you. Thank you, brothers, for that beautiful thought. Amen. Of the mothers. Thank you. Thank you so much. Praise the Lord. One of the attributes of the Lord is that he always thought on others. Amen. Always thought on others. Praise the Lord. The Bible says of him, he went about doing good. He went about doing good. And all of his doing good was for others. Praise our God. That's a beautiful, beautiful trait to have. Amen. Amen. The scripture tells us, look not where. On things of your own, but look where. On things of others. God bless you on this morning. Bless you. Amen. Uh, praise the Lord. Missionary Carr. Amen. Praise the Lord. Uh, Pumpkin, is that you? It's you. All right. You done grow some hair. Amen. Longer. Amen. And, and look like you done. Amen. Change colors on this one. Uh, I'm trying to. Amen. Uh, make sure my glasses ain't fooling me. Amen. Thank God for. Amen. And the little one there. Oh my goodness. Amen. That that's that's a, let's see what is that? Second great niece. No, no. You. Yeah. Second great niece. Oh my. Oh my Lord Jesus. Praise the Lord. Rodney, how you feeling? Pretty huh? that's pretty good. You're blessed. Yes, sir, you are. You're blessed, Rodney. Thank God for you, man. It's good to see you. Good to see you. You 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 taking care of mother all right? Is she hard to handle or is she? Is she he he kind of laughed on that one. He, 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 he didn't want to come in on that one in the public. Praise the Lord. <laughs> Thank God for you today. Thank God for you. Thank the God. Amen. Thank God for these elders. I'm going to be very... Elder Sanders, amen. Thank God for these fine brothers. Amen. Brother Babers, amen. Rodney, amen. Hanging with me. Amen. Praise the Lord. Deacon, amen. Gooden, praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Deacon, amen. Rochelle, amen. Praise the Lord. And uh, 
That little deacon on the end there looking like a preacher this morning. Amen. Got his glasses on, and amen. And, and uh, yeah, praise the Lord. Sister Janice got him looking like a preacher this morning. Amen, Sister Janice. So be careful. If you hear him growling at night, don't get scared. Amen. They didn't got a hold to him. And when he get a hold to you, and nothing you can do about it but just go on and submit. Amen. Thank God, Brother Steve, this morning. Praise the Lord. Amen. 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 Praise the Lord. And that young fella back here with that, amen, clean head and the mask on, thank God for him. He's a, he's a great nephew of mine. Praise the Lord. I'm working on him. I'm working on him. Uh, I'm praying the Lord give me some more to work on him with. Amen. Praise the Lord. Because sometimes, amen, when we think we're tough, God has to work on us a little harder. Isn't that right? But don't fool yourself. He can handle you. Hello, somebody. He can handle you. Isn't that right, Brother Eric? He can handle you. Amen. Thank God for Brother, amen, Brother Lewis this morning. Amen. Praise the Lord. And little Rob there. Amen. Well, Junior Preacher, where's he at this morning? Amen. Y'all got it way back in the back. Amen. Praise the Lord. All right. All right. Amen. I want to train the children to come to the front. Amen. Praise the Lord. Thank God for Deacon Lewis. Amen. Deacon Lewis is, amen, he's looking good. And Lord bless him. He's smiling. Sister Lewis is smiling. Amen. The Lord blessing him. Amen. The Lord blessing him. That's what you, amen, supposed to enjoy. Amen. Why young? Amen. I said I call it young. Why? When? Because they what? Strong. I call it young because they're strong. So say, Alexandra, how you feel, darling? Pretty good. All right. Thank the Lord. Thank the Lord. God bless you this morning. And the Lord keep you is our prayer. Amen. I, I purpose not to keep you long today because many of you, amen, praise the Lord, got some sausage on the smoke. Amen. And some wieners and stuff. And you want to go back to it. Praise the Lord. So I purpose not to keep you long today. Amen. Well, we haven't been staying long anyway, have we? Amen. We've been getting out quick and early. Amen. Y'all go home and do nothing. Amen. Praise the Lord. But thank God for being blessed to be here. Amen. I'm glad for Jesus. What about you? I'm glad for Jesus. Praise the Lord. I'm glad for Jesus. Amen. Thank the Lord. Bless his name. In the word of the Lord this morning, amen, the book of Proverbs, chapter 3. My grandson back there this morning, praise the Lord, I said, now son, amen, uh, uh, Papa may walk and talk today, amen, don't go to sleep, amen, and make sure you don't fool no phone, amen, do not fool no phone in Papa's service, praise the Lord. So I want you to keep up with him on the, on the video there. Amen. Keep up with him on the video. Praise the Lord. Don't, don't fool with the phone. And amen. And lose him. Amen. Thank God for you today. Proverbs chapter 3. Amen. And verse 5. I believe it is chapter 3 in verse 5. Amen. Uh, thank the Lord. Uh -huh. While you're reading, read. Amen. Verse 5, 6, and 7. What does the Bible say? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. That's a plenty, isn't it? That's a plenty. That's a bunch right there, isn't it? First of all, it said, trust in the Lord. Trust in the Lord. Trust in the Lord. Amen. Keep your Bibles handy. Amen. Don't throw them away because we're going to, amen, use them. Praise the Lord. First of all, it said, trust in the Lord. How? With all of thine heart. With all of thine heart. And secondly, he says what? And lean not to thine own understanding. What he's actually saying to you, you are not smart enough. To know what to do. Amen. You're not smart enough. No matter how smart you are, you're not smart enough. Amen. How do you say it? Well, because first of all, you don't even know how you got here. Do you? I don't know how you got here. You just know you were here 
and somebody told you your name, amen, was Armadella, and you start using Armadella. Right? Amen. Isn't that right? Amen. Uh, 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 you know, they got a lot of names now. A lot of, ooh, you can't pronounce these names. Children can't spell their own name. And sometimes I ask them, I say, who gave you that name? She said, oh, uh, my ain't somebody. I said, oh, bless your heart. Amen. She must really didn't love you at all. You know that. But, but uh, the Lord said, trust in, even the, the wise man said, trust in the Lord with all our heart and lean not to know. He, listen, we have got to somehow or another, somewhere, some way, learn or uh, come to, amen, the realization of the fact that we've got to trust in the Lord. We've got to trust in the Lord. Amen. I, I can't drive that point home strong enough because God, amen, and, and I, I hate to say this like this, God has kind of messed us up. Oh, Lord, Pastor. Yes. How so? Because he's allowed us, amen, to get our hands on a few things, on a little stuff that made us feel like we don't really need to lean on him. That's what stuff will do for you, will it not? Amen. Huh? When the Lord blessed the young rich ruler, amen, the young rich ruler, when the Lord blessed him, amen, praise the Lord, he, he said he looked out at, at his crop, Dr. Freeman, and saw how his crop had, amen, just, whoo, my God, overflowed. And the first thing he thought to himself, what shall I do? Ah, man, I got an overflow crop. Oh, got an idea. What this what I'll do? I will tear down my old barns and build some new ones to store what? All my stuff. And I will say to myself, self, look what you got. You don't need nobody. Right? Huh? Amen. You don't need nobody. Praise the Lord. But huh, unfortunately, he forgot who blessed that stuff to grow. He forgot where stuff came from. Right. All my help come from the Lord. Amen. And our trust, our trust, Dr. Freeman, has gone from the Lord and have gone to stuff. Someone was sharing with me this morning, amen, about Four parents. How that our four parents, amen. Uh, somebody mentioned the one of their four parents, amen, had second grade education. Who was that this morning? That Dr. Dr. Freeman. Yeah, Dr. Freeman. Amen. Had second grade education. Praise the Lord. My father had a third grade education, but man, he could count. You couldn't beat him count. Amen. Yeah, God gave them what they didn't have. Amen. Now, God has given us a few things, and we don't think we need God. Glory to God. But our trust needs to be where? In the Lord. Glory to God. On that bill you have, it says, in whom we trust. In God we trust. Not in this green bag. In God we trust. Praise our God. And our trust, amen, should be in the Lord. Because it's God that gives, it's God that allows, it's God that permits. Amen. When God get ready, he can take what he has back from you. Glory to God. He can take it back when he get ready. Glory to God. No matter how much God give you, if God is unpleased or displeased with how you're treating what he give you, God can take it back. And God will take it back. Amen. Hallelujah. He will just start easing out of your hand a little bit at a time. Amen. And the harder you try to keep it, the more it gets out of your hand. The harder you try, amen, the less success you have. Because God is not pleased with how you're treating what he gives you. 
Huh? Acknowledge him how? In all thy ways that what? And he shall what? Direct your path. Praise the Lord. Acknowledge him in all thy ways. He shall direct your path. Thank the Lord. I trust today. We trust. Amen. Listen. We, we trust almost everybody better than we trust the Lord. That's a pretty big statement, Tina. We trust almost everybody better than we trust the Lord. Glory to God. Hallelujah. What you saying, Pastor? Well, let me see if I can get some help here. Brother Rochelle, if I may use you for an example. Praise the Lord. You work on a job, don't you? And you get paid. Amen. And when you get paid, amen, what is the first thing that enters your mind when you get paid? Ties. He's suffering for a little hunger there. Yeah. His ties is the first thing in his mind. Why? Honor the Lord with the first fruits of all thine increase. Honor the Lord. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Bless. Missionary Carl, may I use you for an example? When you get your light bill, how much ever do you pay? You don't pay nothing? Oh, the husband. <laughs> oh, she slipped out of that red creek, didn't she? <laughs> Praise pray the Lord. She slipped out of that right quick, didn't she? Glory to God. Hallelujah. Bless his name. But the, the bottom line is, he pays it, but he pay what? All of it. He pay all of it to the penny. To the penny. We trust everybody better than we trust the Lord. Huh? Glory to God. When you get your tax statement, amen, praise the Lord, of your property tax, you may go and argue with him about it. But most time you lose the argument. Glory to God. It was God's land. It's God's land now. It's God's house now. But they tax you for staying in it. Don't they? And you pay them what they tell you that you owe them. Don't you? And you pay it to the penny. Oh, you all ain't going to like this on Mother's Day. I wish I could do better this year. Praise the God. We trust everybody better than we trust the Lord. We don't trust God that much. When we get our monies, amen, we usually take care of everybody first. And then if there's anything left, we give it to the Lord. And thank God ought to be happy. Brother Eric, hit a key, hit a note or something, would you? I believe the note said, help me, Jesus. Amen. Praise the Lord. I believe it said, help me, Jesus. Thank the Lord. We trust everybody better than we trust the Lord. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Let me get your Bible right quick. And I'm going to have to cut through here quickly because it's Mother's Day. And I said I would not keep you long. Jeremiah 17 and 5 said, thus saith the Lord, cursed be the man that trusteth in man and maketh flesh his own, and whose heart departed from the Lord. Amen. Cursed be the man that trusteth in man and not in the Lord. Glory to God. We've got to somehow, some way, somewhere, some other, amen, come to the realization that God is the one that blesses me. God is the one that keeps me going. God is the one that makes a way for me. God is the one that allowed me to have this job. God is the one that let me get paid on this job. So, I, oh, I, I got to be fair with God. I've got to give God what God requires. If God gives what he requires, he'll bless me with more than I can ever imagine because he'll keep on opening doors for me. He'll keep making ways for me. He'll keep doing for me what I need to be done for me, what I needed to be done. He's that kind.
kind of God. That kind of God. Hallelujah. He's a fair God. Is he not? He's a fair God. Hallelujah. The man went out in the morning. Amen. Praise the Lord. And, and, glory to God. And there came those. Praise the Lord. Amen. They wanted to work. He said, go in the wall. Go, go in the vineyard and work. Amen. Go in the vineyard and work. Amen. Some came 9 o'clock. He said, go in the vineyard and work. Praise the Lord. Some came at 12. He said, go work. Some came at 3. He said, go work. And I'm rushing. Some came at what? 5. And he said, go work. But them came at 5, worked at 6. But them came at 9. God, amen. Hallelujah. Work all day. Thank the Lord. Huh? And got the same pay. Them came at 5. But they complained. They said, wait a minute. We were working all day. He said, no, no, no. I promise you. Didn't I? That I would pay you. Amen. Glory to God. I didn't promise you I was going to pay you about an hour. Hmm. Thank the Lord. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Bless his name. Read Jeremiah 7, 17 and 6. What did it say? I need a good reading now. He shall be like the heath. The person that what? That trusted in man. Shall be like the heath, H E A T H, heath in the desert. And shall not see. Shall not see. When good cometh. When good cometh. But read. Shall, but shall inhabit mm -hmm. the parked places. Yes. In the wilderness. Yes. In salt land. Yes. And not inhabited. Yes. Read the next verse. Blessed is the man. Blessed is the man. That trusteth in the Lord. That trusts who? In the Lord. In the Lord. And whose hope. And whose hope. The Lord is. The Lord is. Hallelujah. You can't be blessed when you're always short changing God. You can't be blessed when you're always cutting God short. God arm is too short. Glory to God for you to box with him. His arm is too short for you to box with him. Thank the Lord. Hallelujah. You're going to lose every time. Blessed are the man what? For he shall be like a tree. Tree. Planted by the water. Planted by what? The water. The waters. Put it out of roots by the river. By the river. It shall not see when heat coming. Come because that water keep watering the roots. Amen. The heat is coming, but the tree's still green because the water is being watered by from the roots. Thank the Lord. Hallelujah. Yes. Glory to God. In, in, in Houston, in Houston. Amen. When I had, I guess, amen, three of these children. Praise the Lord. Y'all remember when the economy crashed in Houston? Amen. The economy crashed in Houston. Praise the Lord. But guess what? I never saw lean time because God kept me with customers that called me. Amen. I said, Cooper, I need you to do this. And God kept me with the customers right through the lean time. Well, other men, amen, closed shop. God kept me running. Amen. You know why? Because I always honor God with God's substance. With my sufferings, whatever it is, always honor God. Even now, amen, hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Every week, God bless me to get here. I write God a check. Praise the Lord, hallelujah. And God opened the door to make sure it don't bounce. Thank the Lord. You know why? Because trusting in the Lord, ah, oh God. Read verse 8. Leaf shall be green. And shall not be careful in the year of drought. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. shall cease from yielding fruit. Yes, yes. Thank you. Listen, I want you to, amen, you're not going to have, I'm not going to have time to read all these. But I do want you, if you got a pen, a pencil, jot them down and go back to them. Praise the Lord. The book of Psalms, one th one Psalm 33 and 18. It says the eyes of the Lord is upon them that fear him. Amen. Praise the Lord. You got a Bible. You can find it fast. What did it say? 33 and 18. Behold, the eye of the Lord is mm -hmm. upon them that fear him, mm -hmm. upon them that hope in his mercy, mm -hmm. to deliver their soul from death, mm -hmm. and to keep them alive in famine. Mm -hmm. In Our what? Famine. In famine. Thank the Lord. Yes. Our soul waited for the Lord. Yes. He is our help mm -hmm. and our shield. Oh, my God. 32 and 10. 
Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Many sorrows shall be to the wicked, mm -hmm. but he that trusteth in the Lord. Many sorrows shall be to the wicked, but he that trusteth the Lord. Mercy shall, shall what? Compassion him about. about. Read. Be glad in the Lord. Be glad in the Lord. And rejoice. Rejoice. Be righteous mm -hmm. and shout for joy. Some 40 and 4. Praise the Lord. Thank you, Lord. Somehow, Brother Babers, we've got to come back to the amen realization that God is the one that keeps us ticking. Yes, 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 yes. Your job is not what keeps you ticking because your job will play out. But God never plays out. And he said that his eyes is where? Upon who? Upon the righteous. And, and what? When the righteous cries, he hears them. But his faith is against them that do evil. Amen. God said, I will never leave you nor forsake you. God said, I will go with you. Not Moses, not Jeremiah, not Ezekiel, not Daniel, not Isaiah, not, praise the Lord, Hosea, not Micah. God said, I will not leave you nor forsake you, but I will go with you all the way, even to the end of the world. Hallelujah. God said, Hallelujah. I'm with you. Praise the Lord. And if I'm with you, I'm more than the world against you. And if I'm for you, who can be against you? I'm greater than the greatest. Hallelujah. I am Alpha and Omega. I'm the beginning and the end. I'm the first and the last. Hallelujah. I'm God Jehovah. I'm God Rapha. I'm God. Uh, yeah. Thank you, sir. You don't have to worry about God. You can't lose with God. You can't lose with God. God is not a loser. Thank you, Lord. He never have lost. No matter what happened, God have never lost. Thank you, Lord. Bless his name. Every battle that the children of Israel got in, if they were with God, they came out victorious because God God brought him out. On the time they were defeated, punkin' was when they had left God. And God let the devil beat him up. He'll do the same thing today. Amen. Same thing today. Praise the Lord. Grab that book, baby. Got to, got to finish. Got to finish. Blessed is the man uh -huh. that maketh the Lord his trust. Mm -hmm. And respecteth not the proud, mm -hmm. nor such as turn aside to lie. Mm -hmm. 64 and 10. Thank the Lord. Yes, yes. If we trust in him, if you trust in him, that seemed to be a terrible letdown today on the part of God. Amen. Not on the part of God, but on the part of man's trust in God. 64 and 10, what did it say? The righteous shall be glad the in the Lord. The righteous shall be glad in the Lord and shall trust, him and shall trust in him. And all and all the upright in heart, in heart shall, glory. shall glory. 118 and 8. Thank the Lord. Hallelujah. Bless his name. If you trust him, saints, if you trust him, thank the Lord. If you trust him, God will bring healing in your family. If you trust him, he'll bring healing in your life. If you trust him, he'll bring healing in your body. If you trust him, he'll bring healing in your soul. If you trust him, hallelujah. Wow! He'll deliver you. Thank you. He'll deliver you from the laws and pestilence. He'll deliver you from the snap of the devil. He'll deliver you from the fiery fox of the devil. He'll deliver you from the pit of hell. If you trust him, no matter how bad it is, no matter how bad it is, if you just trust him, he'll bring you out. Thank you. You may get way, way, way down, but he'll reach way, way down and pick you up. Yes, he will. Mm, yes, he will. Thank you, Lord. 118 and 8. It is better. It is better. To trust in the Lord mm -hmm. than to put confidence in man. What? Man, I tell you this. Whew. 
You tell you, this is me. Some of you sisters right here today can, can attest to the fact that you've been told by some joker that he loved you. And come to find out, bless your heart. Mm, mm, mm. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. I thought, amen, amen, amen. Glory to God. I found out that, amen, amen. Praise the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Mm. Thank you, Lord. But guess what? The Lord speak to you. Amen. The Lord speak to you and said, don't worry. Amen. I love you. Huh? Don't worry. I love you. Thank you. You may be up against it, but I love you. Yes, I love you. I lo and I'm going to see you through. Thank you, Lord. Mm -hmm. 125 and 1. Amen. Praise the Lord. Thank God for Jesus. Hello. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. They that trust in the Lord shall be as Mount Zion. Shall be as Mount Zion. Which cannot be cannot moved. Be moved. But abideth mm -hmm. forever. Yes, and yes. The mountains are round about mm -hmm. Jerusalem. Thank the Lord. So the Lord is round about his people from henceforth even forever. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. That's the God we serve, is it not? That's his name. That's the God we serve. We got to come to. Rebarcus, we done quit trusting in God. God done blessed us to get, a, amen, three quarters above light bill, and we quit trusting in him. And we start trying to see our way through. And the harder you try to see, the darker it gets. Amen. You just be scratching, missionary God, scratching. Not gracious sakes. Goodness. And this simple solution. The simple solution, sister baby, is just treat God fair. Just treat him fair. Huh? Amen. Just treat him fair. And God will make things start falling in place for you. Hello? I wish I had some believers here this morning. He'll make things start falling. The Bible says, if your ways please him, he'll make even your enemy be at peace with you. Now, you know if he's going to make your enemy be at peace with you, he can make a way for you to get a couple of quarters. <laughs> Glory to God. Huh? Thank the Lord. Psalm 30 and 5. So I'm probably 30 and 5. Amen. Praise the Lord. Mm -hmm. Bless his name. Thank you, Lord Jesus. He is what? Praise the Lord. God. Praise his name. My God. What the book said? Every, Every word of God is pure. He is a shield. He is a shield. Unto them that, put unto their them trust that in he, wait, him. wait, 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 wait. God is pure, and he's a shield to who? Unto them, Unto them that, put their trust that put their trust in him. In him. Thank you. Take it out of your 401k because you may lose it all. Put it in him. Hello. Amen. Put it in him. A whole lot of folks, Dr. Freeman, had a whole lot of money in their 401k. When Enron came, they wiped them out. It wiped them out. Glory to God. Yes, it did. Amen. I bought some stock. I had, but I thought, Brother Steve, some of the best stock on the market. Woo! And I was getting the, the Wall Street Journal in, and I'm watching it every morning. Brother Gooden, every morning I see my stock going down, going down. I said, oh, Lord, I got to get rid of this stuff. I ain't going to have nothing. That's just me. Praise the Lord. Glory to God. God can do it, can't he? God can do it. If we trust in him, if we trust in him, if we trust in him, I'm going to get through. Amen. Give me, I got two more points here. Praise the Lord. Uh, Proverbs 14, 26. In the fear of the Lord is what? Praise the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. In the fear of the Lord is strong confidence. 
and his children shall have a place of refuge. In the fear of the Lord is strong confidence, and the children shall have a place of rest, refuge. Psalm 5 and 11 says, what? Let all those that put, put, put their trust in who? In thee. In, let all those put their trust in thee rejoice. Let them ever shout for joy. Hallelujah. Bless his name. Second Samuel, praise the Lord, uh, 23 and 31, and I'm through for this morning. Bless his name. Thank God for Jesus. Yeah, somehow, Brother Eric, we got to quit trusting in what we see. It's not trusting in the Lord. We got to quit trusting in what we see and trust in the Lord. Because what you see can vanish in a second. Thank the Lord. What you see can disappear in a second. Thank the Lord. But listen, God, amen, is a sun and a shield. He's not just a shield, but he's a sun and a shield. That thing, that, that means that he's always shining. Huh? He's always shining. Amen. Praise the Lord. Second Samuel 22 and 31. What did it say? As for the Lord. As for the Lord. His way is perfect. Uh huh. The word of the, the, word Lord, the Lord is for tried. Thank you. He he's been tried in the fire. Thank you, Lord. Ah, bless his name. It's been tried, Dr. Freeman. It's been tried over and over and over. Bless his name. And every time it was tried, he was found to be perfect. Every time it was tried, he was found to be pure. Every time it was tried, he came out successful. That's why the word said, the word is tried and what? He is what? Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's a buckler to all them that trust in him. Thank the Lord. Hallelujah. If you trust him, you'll come out all right. Thank you, Lord. If you trust him, you'll be successful. If you trust him, you can never fail because he's a God that cannot fail. He's a God that won't fail. And I'm so glad, I'm so glad, I'm so glad he will not let you down. He will not forsake you. He will not cast you aside. Thank the Lord. Hallelujah. Oh, bless his name. Oh, bless his name. If you trust the Lord, if you trust the Lord, if you trust God, yes, I know, I know. He's trustworthy. He's trustworthy. Huh? He's trustworthy. Job said, though he slay me, yet will I trust him. Thank you. Yes, sir. He took everything I had, but I'll still trust him. Took the cattle, I'll still trust him. Took the sheep, I'll still trust him. Took my oxen, I'll still trust him. Took my children, I'll still trust him. All ten of them. At one time, I still trust him. My wife left me, but I still trust him. Thank you, Lord. Because I know. Yes, sir. I know. And he'll stand up at the latter day upon the earth. Yes, sir. Hallelujah. I, I may have lost everything I have, but one thing I will not lose my integrity. Yes. Oh, Lord. I keep my hope in the Lord. I keep my trust. In the Lord, I keep my confidence in the Lord. I, I will not. Thank you. Hallelujah. Bless his name. Don't worry. You'll come out. All right. Don't worry. I need it. Look. But you'll come out. All right, don't worry how dark it look, but you'll come out. All right, don't worry because it look like 
you're by yourself and nobody is helping you. Nobody is supporting you. But don't worry, if you trust the Lord, he going to, to make sure you come out all right. He going to make sure you come out on the top. He going to make sure you come out a winner. He going to make sure. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. God bless you today. Mm. I, I didn't mean to go that far. Mm. Thank you, sir. He going to make sure. Don't worry about a man that drowned. He going to make sure that you come out on the top. Mm hmm on the top. Thank you. They wonder how you come out. Thank you, Lord. Bless his name. Like the song said, how did you feel when you come out the wilderness? I felt like shouting. I felt like dancing. I felt like praising the Lord because the Lord brought me out all right because the Lord Give me victory because the Lord, the Lord held my hand because the Lord mm, was manifest because the Lord, yes sir, yes sir, yes sir, yes sir. Thank you. Sir. Shall we stand again? Thank you, sir. Bless him today. Hallelujah. God, God said himself, he's not a God of the many. He's a God of the few. Amen. But he takes a few and does many miraculous things. Because that's the kind of God he is. Praise God. I heard Sister Jackson testify, amen, how mother, amen. I used to watch my mother, amen. It was a whole lot of us, plus my nieces and nephews. My mother raised half of them, praise the Lord. It looked like to me, when time to eat, I sure hate they was there. <laughs> I'm just being truthful. I sure hate they was there. Because I just felt like they're going to eat more than their share and go cut me short. Praise God. Hallelujah. But I don't know how mother did it, but she made that bread. Amen. And she made them biscuits. And they just kept on lasting and lasting and lasting. Huh? Amen. I didn't know a chicken had so many parts. Glory to God. Amen. Hallelujah. She took that one chicken. In the sentence. Amen. You might have got a foot, but you got a chicken. You got some chicken. Amen. You might you got some chicken. Father, thank you today. Thank you today, Lord, for this day. And for these mothers that you've blessed to be mothers. I pray that you'll continue to empower them with mother wit and give them strength in these challenging times when children no longer respect their mothers, when children no longer respect their fathers, when children no longer respect themselves. But God bless these mothers on today and give them strength from on high in the name of Jesus. I rebuke every work of the enemy that comes to discourage them, come to distort them, and to lead them God astray. I bless them in the name of Jesus. I bless them, Lord. I bless their strength. I bless their faith. I bless their courage. I bless their patience. I bless their long suffering. I bless their endurance. I bless them in the name of Jesus. Thank you. Ah, glory to God. Hallelujah. Ah, glory. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. 
In the name of Jesus, bless your people. God bless your people today. Though they trust in you, bless them. Increase their faith. Increase their faith in the name of Jesus. Let what they've heard today inspire them, God, to trust you more than they ever have before. Let what they've heard today inspire them to realize that it's you that makes them successful. And without you, they fail right now. In the name of Jesus, thank you. Bless them now. As they come to give, bless them in their giving. Bless them, God, in their giving. And bless the gift. In Jesus' name we pray. Thank God. Amen. Amen. And thank God. God bless you today. Amen. Brother, would you bring a bandeau? Bless our God. Hallelujah. Praise our God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Blessed be the name of God. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Praise the Lord. Bless him today. Our method has been since the during the pandemic, amen, to give as we depart from the sanctuary and go our separate ways. Amen. That is our method, and it is yet in place. Amen. Until the first Sunday in next month. Amen. And we will resort back to our older method. Amen. Receiving the offering during the service. Praise our God. Pastor. God is